Okay, so colorize this photo. As you can see, it colorized the photo in just 2 or 3 seconds. In just 6 seconds. Now I'm going to tell it, I'm going to make him wearing a hat and make his coat dark green. Wow, look at this. This is kinda insane. Okay, so make this image light type. Wow, look at this. This is the image. The real image and this is the image that is on the night time and then i uploaded another banner image from internet and called uh, to remove the can from here and then it removed the can from this image and then i tell to add this image on this image with the accurate liking and shadow and then this create this so i'll give you moon on the sky and look at this this just gave me a moon on the sky Hello everyone, today in this video we're going to talk about the new image generation AI which is the Gemini 2.0 and was, which is also the experimental and supported by Google. You can use this on the Google AI Studio and this is a very amazing tool to use. So you can see uh, Gemini 2.0 Flash can edit image through many terms of natural language. As you can see, it can wear some flowers to the table and it edits some flowers to the table and now uh you want if you want another flower like red tulips as you can see it added some flower with the red tulips here so that's very amazing to use and also it can create long sentences in an image so as you can see this image was generated by gmnet on flash you can use it to generate images so it's also showing the same sentences with accurate correct and spelling as you can see so to use this, you just need to go to the Google AI Studio, search for the Google AI Studio and go to this googleaistudio.com. I just need a Gmail account to sign in or log in with the Google AI Studio account. And this is the interface you will be given. So after that, you just need to go to this right option, the model, and you need to choose this Gemini 2.1 Flash image generation, which is experimental, and you can choose images and text. Now we're going to talk about the prompt here. So they have image editing option, visual story and what they got. So these are the example you can use to use the AI Studio. First, if I go to the image editing option. Now as you can see, they're showing that add some chocolate drizzle to the croissants. And as you can see, they added some chocolate drizzle to the croissants. And now if I want to add something else like add some red sauce on the top. And click run here. Now see how fast it will generate the image here. It took only 5 seconds. And as you can see, it really added some red sauce on the top. Now if I want to make it another thing, you can do it. So change the color of the croissant. Change the color of the croissant in pink. As you can see, it changes the color of the croissant into pink. So this is how the image editing option goes. So if you have your own image, like go to this plus icon and upload your file. And also you can use the sample media. So let's say if I go to the sample media and let's say these are the image from my PC. And if I choose this image from here and add to prompt. And let's say I want to edit this image and I want to make this image into a nighttime. So make this, as you can see, this is the real image. And this is the image that it gave. It make it nighttime and also give it a moon hair. Now if I go to the again create prompt option. And this is the option of visual story. So just click it. And you can generate a story about anything. And you want picture by picture scene scenario here. Like you see get 3D coordination style for each scene generate an image. And it also create an image and also create the story here. So you can use this for your children book or you can make these images to create videos with other AI video generation. So this is the idea to create any visual story with Google AI Studio. So the images also are perfect here, very high quality here. And look how fast it is creating the images and also the stories. You can create your own visual story project or not just visual story. You can create your own project like if you want to create a recipe like give me a recipe on how to cook egg fried rice with every image step by step describing it. So just click run. 
and it will start to give you the whole recipe and also it will start to give you the ingredients images and also the step by step images that you want to create egg fried rice so this will give you the, all the images that you want step by step and also you can use this image for any educational purpose if you have any project with other ideas so this is another very useful use case you can do this with google ai studio image generation now let's go to the create prompt again and there's a option to create birthday card so this will create any type of card like a birthday card or wedding card if you want to create like generate a design for birthday card with beautiful floral decoration and you can also use the the text should be large and say happy birthday and this is the image as you can see now if you want to create an any type of card you can create here so these are the three prompt that you can use to create anything with the imagination it has other things that i have created also it can create large you know, text generation images that i've showed you with the example for example if i want to create my image like a man like a man writing in a board this is a large sentence for the generate for image generator and click run and as you can see this is a large sentence to generate for ai image generator now here's some of so the letter got blurred but the spell is correct and as you can see this is a board and the spelling correct is also fine so the image generation can do also large sentences and give correct text okay so now here's a picture of a man standing now make this image into a side view of this image so just click run and as you can see this is the original image and this is the side view of the image so this is how you can manipulation also the image now if I am going to upload a product here the make him holding this boom box so just click run and as you can see this is the side image of the man holding the boom box the exact boom box that I have provided in the image shot. so this is also a very useful tool for you to create designing option or if you want to use for your product you can use it which is very easy and it only took 7 to 10 seconds now here is the interesting thing also in the imagination upload a picture from internet and call this is my product and then i uploaded another banner image from internet and called uh, to remove the can from here and then it removed the can from this image as you can see remove the can from this image and if i go down then i tell to add this image on this image with the accurate lighting and shadow and then this create this so this is a pretty amazing tool to use for if you're a designer you can get the idea or you can also change something and add it to the photoshop then edit it so it will make so much easier to make your design if you know the right tool to use so there are a lot of ways you can use it the uh, google ai imagination which is totally free right now you can just come up to here and use this for free so that's it guys this is what i want to show you and share with you that Google AI Gemini is the game changer which could possibly can change uh, the editing of the photo that he, we used to edit in Photoshop. So it's better to use the AI tool and get used to it so you can get ahead of the game. So if you found this video helpful, please subscribe and thank you for watching.